Hello everyone, welcome to I am a cooker channel. Today we are going to make a traditional South Indian Kerala curry. It's made out of ginger, so we are going to call it ginger curry or in Malayalam it's called as inji curry. Very tasty dish, you just need a little bit with your rice and it tastes so yummy. So we are going to make that today. Let's go ahead and go for the ingredients. All the ingredients I have put it in the description box. You can check it out there. And let's get started. To a hot pan, I'm going to add 2 tablespoons of coconut oil. And when we are making this curry, make sure you keep it on a medium flame throughout the entire procedure. Next we are going to add 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds. After the mustard splutters, add 2 tablespoons of sliced coconut. We are going to saute the coconut until it becomes light brown in color. And to this I am going to add 4 cloves of garlic which I have chopped finely. Add 8 shallots which I have chopped. Next we are going to add the main ingredient which is the ginger. I have taken 1 pound and chopped it up finely. We are going to add it. We are going to saute it. Saute the ginger on a medium flame till it changes color. Our main goal is to bring it to a light brown and not burn it. After constantly stirring for a while, the color has started to change and the raw smell of the ginger is gone. To this now we are going to add curry leaves. Mix everything. Now I am going to add 2 tablespoons of chili powder. Half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, quarter teaspoon of fenugreek powder, and two pinch of asafoetida. Mix everything together. Next, I have taken a grape sized tamarind, soaked it in water. Now we are going to add the water to the ginger. Add half a cup of water and adjust the salt according to your taste. Once it comes to a boil, we are going to cover and cook it on a medium flame for 4 to 5 minutes. After 4 minutes, my curry is cooked perfectly. This is the consistency which we want. And to this, now I am going to add half a tablespoon of sugar. This balance all the spices. And one tablespoon of vinegar. Now our delicious ginger curry or inji curry is ready now. Let's serve it onto a plate. Now let's try the ginger curry recipe. You just take a little bit, put it on hot steaming rice and the best way to eat is using your hands. It's hot. Mix it and then take out a little bit. Make a ball like this. 
and wow it's so good like it brings back the old memories of my childhood days if you liked our video please like share and subscribe to our channel and enjoy our recipe thank you